So, Niners fans. <laughs> oh, that shit is funny to me. So, you think Trey's your answer? You still think he's your future savior still? (laughs) Oh my God, bro. Listen, when you can't even beat out Sam Darnold for a backup spot, you know something's wrong with you. Like, Trey's era, the era of Trey Lance is over, bro, in San Francisco. Like, so it was reported that Trey Lance ain't even the goddamn backup. He's the fucking third string quarterback. Like, I understand if you want to give, like, Brock Purdy the job. Like, Brock Purdy is better than Trey Lance. I understand that. But Sam Darnold? I wasn't shocked when I heard the news. I saw it coming a mile away when there were reports of Trey Lance struggling in that first preseason game where he looked awful. And even though he did have a good moment, but let's be honest, that was Den- that was against Denver's backups who probably won't even make the goddamn roster. And Jake Moody, who that kick barely even made the field goal. Like, let's be perfectly honest here. Like, I saw the writing on the tray from a mile away. I was just waiting for the right time to, to come out and say that I was right. And guess what? I was right. Brock Purdy is your starter. And guess who's the backup? It's Sam Darnold. But let me tell you something. As much as y'all continue to deny it, and y'all to this day still do, Y'all should have drafted Justin Fields. Y'all should... At this point, Mac Jones probably would have been a fucking better option than Trey Lance. And Niners fans can get mad at me all they want, but Mac Jones basically is like Jimmy Garoppolo. He fits the system well. Trey doesn't fit... Like, Trey is a raw prospect. That's why teams were not... Were questioning on his ability. That's why I think Anthony Richardson's going to fail because he was a raw prospect that only started one year and entered in the NFL way too early instead of staying another year in college. And maybe, just maybe, he could have been the first overall pick. But newsflash, he entered the NFL way too soon. Like I said, the NFL should have a time limit that you need to play two seasons in the in in college to in order to declare for the draft other than that you need to stay for like you need to play for like two seasons like no one season then be like oh what well, well, i guess we'll welcome this kid in this fucking no trey lance should have been smart and be like okay the nfl is a totally different one from college i'll stay in college for another year and maybe i'll declare for the draft but Loose flash, Trey. Quarterbacks that, and I know people are going to say, oh, that Trey Lance is going to light it up somewhere. He's going to go to a team like the Falcons or the Vikings, which I really hope the Vikings do end up trading for him because, you know, him being a raw prospect and him entering the draft so soon and him failing in San Francisco, I want the Vikings to trade for Trey Lance. Like they're done with Kirk Cousins after this year, I'm, and then uh, who's their backup? Nick Mullins. I mean, Trey Lance. Honestly, I want the Vikings to trade for Trey Lance. Like, let's be perfectly honest. I want the Vikings to, because I want like as much as I shit on Kirk Cousins on a daily. I'll admit Kirk Cousins is way better than Trey Lance, but. They're gonna, they're gonna eventually, like, 
start Trey, and then he's going to flop. Like, I see it coming. I see Trey Lance getting traded to the Light Queens pretty, pretty soon. Now, could I be wrong about this? Yeah, I could be wrong, and he could still be on the Niners, just we will never see him because, you know, obviously, you know, when you're the quarterback three, you don't see the field unless, like, multiple injuries happen, which can happen because it's the 49ers have a history of having injured players and Trey Lance could come in I guess but let's be honest do we you really think that Trey can ever succeed on the 49ers even though the 49ers invested in so much and give they were better off staying where they're at and getting Mac Jones I mean let Carolina have Trey Lance and then, I mean, to be honest, we're glad y'all passed up on Fields. And when he lights up the league this year and he wins a Super Bowl eventually, y'all get ready to hear that Justin Fields should have been a 49er. Get ready to hear that shit. Because I'm going to enjoy it, bro. I'm glad we got a generational talent in Justin Fields. Meanwhile... Y'all were stuck with Trey Lance. But remember, he's the king of the NFC. But, like I said, this, this 49ers, bro, they're probably the greatest team this past decade to never win a Super Bowl because they don't have a good quarterback. Like I said, Brock Purdy just needs to do it again in order for me to believe it. Darnold. Like I said, if you if you can't beat out Sam Darnold, then something's wrong with you, bro. Like Darnold is a game manager at best. Like he, like bro, I would have kept Jimmy Garoppolo over Sam Darnold. At least Jimmy Garoppolo doesn't turn over the ball often. Sam Darnold throws a pick every chance he every chance he gets, bro. Like there's a reason why the Panthers and the Jets gave up on him. They just said, nah, we're going with Zach Wilson, even though they're with the Aaron Rodgers out. Mm, the Panthers like, nah, we'll take a, a quarterback in Bryce Young. Like, at this point, Trey's career is done in San Francisco. Yeah, I don't want to say career because, you know, if, if, if I hear, if I say career, like his entire NFL career, then I'll get a multi-paragraph essay about how Drew Brees failed on the Chargers and then, he, you know, he resurrected his career his career in fucking New Orleans. Like, even though that that's a dumb comparison because Drew Brees was, is a way better quarterback than uh, Trey Lance. Like, at the end of the day, Niners, you're in denial, bro. I keep hearing, oh, Kyle would have ruined Justin Fields. Oh, Kyle this, Kyle that. Nah, 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 nah. Don't give me that crap. Don't give me that bullshit. You know it. I know it. That Justin Fields was the right pick. Y'all would have been fine drafting Mac Jones, but y'all drafted a raw prospect. Y'all, to be honest, it's drafting Kyle Trask might have been the better option. Nah, nah, nah. I think I'm I think I'm reaching at this point. But let's be honest, folks. Trey's done. He's done at this point. Niners fans, you're going to have to accept it. He's gone. It's only a matter of time. So anyways, that's it. That's all for today's video. As always, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.